Welcome back to the VOD Box. This week's vodka is a really interesting vodka. No other vodka has been distilled this much and it comes attached to the one of the most amazing uh, blenders of alcohol uh, distillers in the world, Thomas Kuninen. He's from Sweden and he's 120% Swedish. We had a dinner with him recently here and he said to us when we're taking, tasting the vodka and in front of the whole crowd he says, he says, I don't really care if you like this vodka, but I like it. And that's what counts. And I think that's that's what's great about an artist. I mean, somebody that really loves what they're doing. And he was fabulous. I mean, it, it made me love him even more. And uh, he loves his heritage in Sweden. Sweden's one of the most famous countries for making vodka. And he makes it in the Elgin Castle in southern Sweden. And he distills this vodka 34 times. It actually looks like a prism. And he makes it in a small pot distillery made of gold and copper. Now he dis distills this very slowly and you're thinking that when you distill this 34 times you're going to lose a lot of the flavor. But he's, his technique in this is to do it very slow, capture all the flavor, and 90% of this is cooked off. So you just have a very small 10% of the distillate left in the, in, to, to, to make your vodka from and it is full of flavor. He says, and I say also, that vodka, they say that vodka has no taste. It has amazing taste. And after 34 times distilled, this has an amazing flavor. Uh, it's, a, it's a really proud uh, vodka made with Swedish heritage in pot distilled. And I think this is an amazing vodka for a martini. Uh, the taste is beautiful. It's made from a winter wheat. And if you want to have something really pure, really sweet, and very delicious, come to the VOD box and have a purity. This week's vodka of the week. This would be Skol. Oh, I can taste the wheat, and it's just an elegant taste. And uh, I would say Skol to you. See you next.